didn't really swat it, kind of tipped it up in the air as Leaky Black gets an open court steal, and he'll finish with two hands on the other side. To Black, now to Baycott. He'll pull up mid-range and drop it home down the right baseline for two. It is 30 to 15. Largest deficit Carolina's come back from this year is 14. R.J. Davis deep into the lane and forces it up and over Marsh for two. Baycott waits now to give it to a trailing R.J. Davis. Weaving through traffic to Baycott to the rim for two more. And now Wake Forest is going to take a timeout. 40 to 23. Nance floats it down low to Baycott for the left-handed finish. Comes out of traffic and kicks it out to Love for a three-pointer on the right sideline, which is good. Leaky Black the other way for Carolina. Coast to coast, kicks it right corner to R.J. Davis. He'll penetrate in and get to the rim for the layup. Nance got deep, and Nance just violently rejects the shot down low. Gets it to Love. Love, front court left side, gets to the rim for two. Backing in left side. Nance against Carr, still working. Hooks it up, and two more. Nickel around the screen. Nice bounce pass to Nance, and he finishes strong right of the lane. Davis right down the center of the floor. Hesitate, finds Trimble. Oh, hung in the air down the baseline. Started on the left and finished on the right side. Misses a long three. Again, the door is cracked here for Carolina. As Puff Johnson quickly the other way, leaves it for Baycott. He scores and draws the foul. Now you got to get something on this possession. It's going to be Love driving in on the left, and he hits the runner. Carolina will take a timeout. Appleby has taken 40 shots between free throws and field goals. A mile-long three by Love is good. 85-75. Love going to try another long three. Got it again. But Nance had never had a chance. Both free throws good. Love the other way. Hits another three to make it 92-85.